अगर तुमने बेल आइकन पे क्लिक नहीं किया तो मेरी जहरीली गैस इस महफिल को और रंगीन कर देगी द ग्रेटेस्ट मूवी नेवर मेड Before Rajinikanth's 2.0 took the crown as the movie with the biggest budget in India, there was a time way back in the year 1997 to be specific when veteran Kamal Hassan launched the most ambitious project till date called Marudha Nayaka. The film was launched by Queen Elizabeth II. Yes, the Queen of England launched a movie about an Indian freedom fighter. You can't say Kamal Hassan doesn't have charm. Based on the life of freedom fighter Yusuf Khan, this epic period drama was estimated to have a budget of 80 crore crores, which in 2018 would be around 700 crores. That's a bigger budget than 2.0. The film boasted an amazing group of Indian and international technicians and writers, including Academy Award-winning writer Jean Claude Carey and Academy Award-winning composer Andrew Lloyd Webber. Not to mention Elay Raja, Sandhu Shivan, and Ravi Chandra. And if that wasn't massive enough, on screen Kamal Hassan tried to cast Kate Winslet as the female lead. Yes, Kate Winslet. But the plan went the same way as the Titanic, the ship. not the movie despite the setback kamal hasan managed to rope in om puri amrish puri and nasser in the lead roles not to mention approach amida bachan and rajini gant to do cameos in the film and when filming started in jaipur along with 7000 costumes and accessories and a massive set things seemed to be on track and what could possibly go wrong the first warning signal was from a group who started a protest against the movie claiming it to be historically inaccurate forcing kamal to abandon the sets seem familiar Next, well, the money went the way of the dodo when the British company co-producing the film backed out a few weeks after that, costing Kamal around 8 crores of his own money and putting the movie on hold. But that's not the end of Mardana Aayega. After being stuck in development hell in 2004, Kamal Hasan approached many Hollywood production companies to fund the project, but was turned down. and even released a silent 2 minute trailer in 2008 and appealed to Fox Studios and was turned down again. Mardana Aayega, Avadan Mardana Aayega. But Mighty Thor Aegam is one movie that refuses to quit. In 2016, yes, 8 years after the trailer came out, a song for the film composed by Elay Raja was released online, sparking rumors of a revival. And if you thought that was one last melodic goodbye from the film, you thought wrong because a poster of the film showcased last year at Cannes. Officially, no announcement has been made for a renewal. And with Kamal Hasan busy with Vishrubham 2 and Indian 2, it seems unlikely the film will be renewed. But as we said earlier, Marudha Nayagam is one movie that refuses to quit. So there you have it. Our thoughts on Marudha Nayagam, the greatest movie never made. Do share your thoughts in the comments below and keep watching Desi Martini. Okay.